Hey everyone, welcome back to my Connected Franchise Rebuilding the Oakland Raiders. This week we take on the Seattle Seahawks. Not to disappoint anybody, but this video is going to be relatively cut up and not very good. Um, the only reason I'm posting it is to keep you guys up to date on what's happened. Um, something happened with uh, transferring a lot of the video. Um, my PlayStation got shut off, which corrupted all the video that went on to my hard drive. And I'm, I'm missing quite a bit of film. <clears throat> but you get the picture this week I take on the Seattle Seahawks um, I wasn't ready let's just put it that way things didn't go my way I got picked off a couple times and you'll see in the end that I eventually just let the clock run out well actually I don't actually I tried to come back a little bit to make the score not so one-sided and I end up um, turning it over on downs and I think I actually cut that out I just I got so pissed off with this game <laughs> it was awful I was swearing up a storm uh, Derek Carr ends up getting hurt in the first first quarter again and I'm stuck with Schwab who sucks and my offense just stalled out against a great defense I don't have a strong offense um, in fact actually most of their points came um, came because my offense wasn't that strong I think Wilson scored had two touchdowns and that was it well now they still well if now looking back on it, it, they wouldn't have won if my offense didn't stall out because I ended up throwing an interception for a touchdown, which is just awful. I was really upset with this game. I exited out really quick in the end, so I didn't look at the stats, but it wasn't good news for me. And I just make horrible, horrible calls throughout this game. I think we've heard this expression about 7,000 times. It's a um, league, so we all know that. So you got to be able to throw the but, ball and pick up some first um, I did manage to play more than one game this week. So after this gets all uploaded to YouTube, I'll start working on the second video, which I still have it's all on my PlayStation and and in good order hopefully I'm just I'm really bumming about this game because now now that I'm making the movie I remember how awful it was and um, more news on my front of up for my channel I'm gonna end up doing walkthroughs of some of the games that I have um, the first one I'm gonna work on the game's older but I really enjoyed it when I was still playing it um, I'm gonna be making a walkthrough for watchdogs so stay tuned for those that are gonna be coming out relatively soon um, probably Tuesday sometime the first video will be up I have a lot going on this weekend I'm gonna be moving and I have school finals to get done so uh, those that video will be delayed but it will be coming and I'll have a whole video series on watchdogs and probably any games that I do get for Christmas I'll end up making walkthroughs for because I'm actually enjoying this. Granted, I wish my video feed didn't suck. Uh, I probably need to find a better method for transferring videos without damaging the video so I can't use it. But until that time, I will continue with what I'm doing. Hopefully, I don't lose anything important. And 
a later time. Well, thank you for watching. Like, su subscribe, and comment. Yeah. Sorry about this video again. It's just awful. And happy holidays to you all. See you soon. Second down coming up. Split backfield here. They're setting up screen. Chancellor's there to take him down. Good job by the offense. Another first down. The defense absolutely is getting tired. And when you get tired, you make mistakes. First down here after the completion. Maurice Jones-Drew gets it here. And he gained maybe three. Got to stay patient with the run game. That's what the offense is doing here. Even though they haven't had any big games yet, there's a little short game that time, but you're hoping to break one sooner or later. The Raiders will take the snap from the 35. He's tackled right at the 31. That was a power running play that time by the offense. It picked up some good yards. Nothing like it. Show the defense you're willing to get in there and slug it out and get some tough running yards. My goodness, what a hit. And the ball falls incomplete. Raiders, the second guess that play call, that time on third short. They throw the football. Everybody thought they were going to run it. They were trying to be too clever, and it backfired down fourth down. Split backfield here. Out of the gun makes the reception and that's a gain of 13. When you have an offense like this that just keeps getting first downs, not only are they moving in scoring position, but they're giving their defense a lot of rest. This long drive continues. First and 10. Will run it. Here's the handoff. Second down now. Mounting a serious drive. The tackle was made. You must be very creative in the red zone when it comes to the passing game. Formations, movement, do whatever it takes to give your players an advantage. That time they get a nice play call. They throw the pass and complete it for a good solid pickup. Raiders, touchdown. Touchdown, Raiders. Well, he's one of the best in the NFL when it comes to finding his way into the end zone. That time he finds a way to get in there and get the touchdown to look down the field if there's nobody open throw it to the drag route coming across the field that time they did it it's just short of getting the first down pass it is intercepted it's wide open Seattle is in for the score get rid of the clock you gotta run Phil this was a tough loss to handle yeah it was so much confidence coming into the game thinking you had the game plan your team was healthy nothing could go wrong and then it does. You make the mistakes and you lose. Tough to take. What a memorable game this truly was. For Phil Simms, Danielle Bellini, and Larry Ridley, Jim Nance saying so long for now, and we leave you with the GMC Never Say Never moment of the game.